Hey guys, JB here, and I'm with a new video. In this video, I'm going to be talking about five Terraria rumors that were proven false for Terraria 1.2.4, iOS, and Android. And people may or may not still believe them, but they have been proven false, and let's get into the video. So the first rumor, I don't really think I need to even show any proof for this, but... It's, the first rumor was that Terraria 1.3 was never going to come out for mobile, which mobile is iOS and Android, and yeah... As of right now, recording this, it's 1.2.4, and if you guys have watched my other videos, which I'll be on the screen now, as well as in the description, as well in the comment section, I'll be putting the videos talking about my 1.3 mobile news, as well as all the information we know as of so far. And, yeah. So, the first rumor we had was that 1.3 was never going to come out for mobile. So, I got comments like this so much... I got, like, I, I don't have any screenshots because it was, like, e a year ago. But so many people were expecting Terraria 1.3 never to come out for mobile for multiple reasons, such as, oh, the Moon Lord is too big of a boss. How is this, your mobile screen going to be able to handle that? Or how is the Zoom going to work? Or uh, the RAM requirements and blah, blah, blah. Coming up next is another rumor about Troy 1.3 that was around, I would say, it was in 2016, around June. So as you guys may or may not have known, if you guys go to the multiplayer for Terraria on iOS, you may have heard of this, but there was a rumor going around that Terraria 1.3 for mobile was going to come out on June 30th of 2016. So, I have some pictures that I'm showing on the screen now. So basically, I was getting comments, I was going over multiplayer for Terraria, and I would see so many people talking, oh my god, I'm so hyped for Terraria 1.3, I can't believe it's coming out, and blah blah blah, in many days. Because, yeah, people thought it was going to be June 30th, 2016, and next thing you know, when it passes that day, people are like, oh god, where, do, where is it? I'm going to cry, I'm going to rip my hair out and everything. Coming up next is our final 1.3 rumor, and that was going to be that Terraria 1.3 for mobile and Android will reset all of our progress as well as our world and players. So I'll show a screenshot now of a person on Twitter actually tweeting to the Terraria official account, and they responded saying that they will not reset our progress, which I never thought was going to happen. I mean, like, why would they reset our progress? I don't know who started this rumor, but to be completely honest, it sounds kind of dumb. It's uh, not as dumb as making up a release date and spreading it around like as if it was true. But, oh, to be honest, they're both rumors that are untrue. And the reason that why people thought that at one point was because of the rumors, and yeah. So, uh, yeah, let's, let's move on. Coming up next is that Terraria developers have Kick. So, as you guys may know, Kick is a chat app where you can actually chat with people using by their username. You don't need their phone number or their email address. You can just text them by looking up their username. I have Kick. I have friends who have Kick. And basically, so many people, I would say, I'm showing a lot, a lot of screenshots of many fake people who use Kick. These are people who are pretending to be developers who are not real, such as, let me just show some pictures. As of right now, there's people pretending to be ReLogic, 5.5 Games, Senex, um, Chrono, and then there's Andrew, and then, yeah, as you can see, there's a lot of them, which I think is really dumb, because, well, as of I know... As far as everybody knows, only one developer has Kick, and that is, of course, Aaron C, who I've done videos with, I've done videos about in the past, and I've talked about before. But yeah. So last but certainly not least is that the Terraria developers do not play on mobile, and when I say mobile, I mean on Terraria for iOS and Android. And when you think about it, that is actually a really dumb statement because. Why would the developers not play in mobile if they created it for mobile also? I mean, I know they have PC, and I know PC is more content and features that iOS and Android don't have yet. And I know that PC is always going to be ahead as far as updates than mobile. But if you think about it, they did also create mobile, the Terraria mobile. 
So, what makes you think they wouldn't want to play it? I mean, there are beta testers, there are bug reporters, so they may or may not need to find bugs themselves, but there are, and they do, play on a mobile. And I have played with some in the past, and as far as personal experience, they do play. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, make sure to smack that like button and subscribe for more videos. And if you guys did, make sure to smack that like button with your nose like this. And I'll see you guys next time. <gasps> <laughs>